My life's in a pickle again. <laughs> oh man, I remember the time I I did that uh, for the announcement video I made back uh, two years ago. And yes, I am wearing my secondary uniform because this was recorded around the same day as Central States Marching Festival. So I needed to get ready. So I decided, you know what, I'm just going to record with my secondary uniform on. So if it offends any of you, any of you out there who is in the marching band and sees this video, I apologize in advance. So this is basically an update video. Well, not an update, but an announcement to make. As of today, I am no longer going to be streaming on Twitch. I know, criminal. But here's the reason why I am deciding to move Twitch and moving over to YouTube streaming this time around. The reason why is because there's been some problems with Twitch, which has caused many Twitch streamers to be streaming on YouTube now, and that's fair. But the main reason why I'm moving over to YouTube streaming is because of viewership. On YouTube, on this channel, I have 852 subscribers. On my playthrough channel, NateDog19Plays, which if you haven't subscribed to that one, I highly suggest you do so. I do many great. Uh, gameplays of video games like Mario Kart Wii and pretty soon Mario Rabbit Sparks of Hope and might show off some other games in my interest. Only has 67 subscribers but I don't stream on that channel so it doesn't make a difference. But on Twitch that is a whole different story. I only have 37 followers on Twitch and those 37 followers doesn't make a difference. On Twitch, I would get one to two, sometimes three viewers maximum. And that is not a whole lot of viewers. To me, streaming is nothing more than just building up a community. It is building up a community more than earning, earning revenue from your streams. But when I hit a thousand subscribers on YouTube, then we'll talk. But until then, it's just nothing more than just building up a community, a community and making friends with that community to show off games that best fits their interests as well as my interests. So that is why I want to switch over to YouTube to build up the community. Because 852 subscribers versus 37 followers with one to two viewers maximum makes a whole lot difference. So that is why I'm streaming, decided to stream on YouTube now. But just because I am not gonna be streaming on Twitch anymore, does not mean that my Twitch channel will be deleted. In fact, it is staying where it's at. In fact, I watch Twitch streamers on an occasion basis if my work slash school schedule allows me to. So that's basically all I have to say about the future of my Twitch. But there will be changes to the channel. And what I do, will use in my videos. Like for example, the green screen that I've been using, this one right here, that is going to change. Instead of saying, follow me on Twitch, Twitter, and Discord, it is just going to say, follow me on Twitter and Discord. The links will be down in the description below. Another change is I will be streaming on this channel because that's the channel that has more subscribers. But after I am done with the stream, the streams will be set as unlisted and they will be archived to a new channel that I created, Nate Dog 19 live streams. The link to the channel will be down in the description below so that way you have access to the channel. So when I stream and when I archive the streams, they'll be sent over to that channel. And when I decide, hey, you know what, that one should be good for the playthrough channel, they will be edited, sent over to the playthrough channel. Whereas with the archive streams channel, it's not gonna be edited. It's gonna be the full stream 
from the time it starts to the time it ends. That's basically it. So that's the announcement I have to make. Goodbye Twitch. Hello YouTube streaming. Haha. <laughs>